Oh, right. Yeah, this is a PayPal request from Ruli. Um, actually, I've known from him for a while, so it's nice that they're still to know they're still out there. Um, but yeah, they picked this. Chris Cornell. First off, is a cover of Hotel California. Then the audio save it is audio save in it. That was a Chris Cornell song that I've only really started to listen to. Like now, I reacted to it ages ago, but I did so much Chris Cornell that. <clears throat> Do you know what I mean? I had about two months of just listening to Seasons. But yeah. Um, Hotel California as well. Hotel California is another one, like Paranoid, where there's certain songs that they're so big and you hear them all the time. But they're still good when you hear them. It's one of my favourite lines in this film as well. Some dance to remember, some dance to forget. That's... Like, especially if you've been raving or gone clubbing, you see that. You see, like, the the like older lot. They're dancing to remember their days when they were wild. And all the young are in there dancing to forget. Like, to, to be something else for a night. Do you know what I mean? I just think that line is so great. Like, but yeah, and like I say... I went raving, and I just, that line is just great. But there's a lot of great lines in Hotel California. But yeah, anyway, I'm looking forward to this, because I can already hear Chris Cornell's voice on Hotel California. This is just fire. Because yeah, like I say, it's, it's a massive song, but I love the song. Um, yeah, so let's go. Hi, sweetheart. I bore her with us at home. Such a lovely place, such a lovely place. Little man from Hotel California. He actually sounds.
such a lovely place Such a lovely place There's plenty of room now For Hotel California In the time of year You can find it here Mirrors on the ceiling Playing champagne on ice. We are all just prisoners here of our own devices. And in the master's chamber, the gather for feet. The stabbing with their stealing knives, what the fucking killed me. Last thing I remember. You can check out any time you like But you can never leave Welcome to the Hotel California Such a lovely place Such a lovely place There's plenty of room at the Hotel At a time of year, you can find me here. Thank you. First, <clears throat> he didn't sing how I expected him to sing, to be fair. He had a much more like, almost like a country sound to him. Especially one of the lines, like it it wasn't the blow you away. It was like a much more, like I say, more folky, more, well, I mean, he is playing, it's just him and a guitar, but still, when even when he's with a guitar, he like, do you know what I mean? He can still pack a punch with his voice, but this one was more like, I don't think I've ever heard Chris Cornell sound so like, like that, basically, like like I say, a bit more folky, a bit more country, um, but it's such a great tune. And just listening to the lyrics of it, uh, I love. I just the lyrics to it is great. She has a lot of pretty, pretty boys that she calls men. Now again, like you just know what that means, like. Yeah, he doesn't get it. But um, also, that's the other one. We are all just prisoners here of our own device. Now, take that as vice. Because I always thought that with the line, um, you can check out any time you want, but you can't never leave. When I think everybody goes through their stage of like, party and it might only be like for not that long some people is a, like a month they'll do a and then that's it they kind of got it out of their system but like when you have them like when you're in them days where you're like yeah same the more debauchery side of life you can check out anytime you want <clears throat> and it, but not just in that that's how i just see it but it can be in anything in life really that you want to do <clears throat> everything you do in life that like you can check out anytime you want you can stop doing that when anytime you want but you can't leave the decisions you made during this thing will live with you forever and it carries on but you can check out so say if you're like like i say Take drinking, it's, that's the most widely, um, I'd say, used, other than smoking, but smoking's a bit different. But we we'll take drinking. People go out, especially in this country, every 
Friday, Saturday, that's what it is. All this country is, is building up for them two days and then recovering until they come around again. <clears throat> but when you go out and you're getting drunk and you're doing shit, you end up doing things that you wouldn't do in your right mind. And you can't ever leave that. You can never take back that, what you did. Now, you can move somewhere and no one know you and no one know your crazy days, but you do. And, yeah, I just, that line is, the whole song, to be fair, is just so, yeah, it's amazing. The words to it are just so great. And I think that's probably why it's one of them songs that, a bit like Paranoid too, the words in Paranoid is just great. Um, but, yeah, that was fire. But, yeah, now we got like Stone. Hold on. All right, yeah. Let's uh, finish this, let's go. Like a stone. This is a tune. Like I say, this was one of the ones that I uh, took me longer to appreciate properly. Properly. Do you know what I mean? I liked the tune when I heard it, but yeah, I've actually like gone through a stage of just listening to that. But yeah, let's go. <laughs>
Thank you. That was fire. First, let's talk about his voice. The tone of his voice on that. Like, that was kind of what I was expecting from the Hotel California. But like I say, the Hotel California one was different. It was like a, yeah, like I say, more folky. Um, but listening to that, do you know what? I want to go back and do, because I did the one in the studio of that. I want to go back and do that again, actually. Hearing that now. Because it does, it reminds me, it's the best thing I've ever, like, for advice. Someone asked Noel Gallagher advice for songwriters. And he said, write your songs on an acoustic guitar. And then rock them up. He's like, people nowadays think that they get electric guitar, write songs on it. He's like, and your songs will be garbage. But if you write a song on an acoustic guitar and then rock it up with electric guitar, it's it's like that's how you make and you can hear it with that. I mean, even though this is quite a slow tune, but there's more like production, obviously. But hearing it like that, you hear the 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 craft of the song. That's what I mean. Chris Cornell really had a a master, a masterful songwriting ability and hearing that's why I, that's one thing and i'm not really like one of them people that's like um anyway if there's one thing i i wish i could do it would be go to a chris cornell acoustic night i'm really like that's what i can say i'm really not someone who likes to go to things like i don't like i've been to a couple of gigs i've been to some festivals whatever but it's like yeah it's all right do you know what i mean but that watching chris cornell with an with a just a, a acoustic guitar going through songs yeah that would that i would have a hundred percent gone to and i just wish that i didn't find him sooner basically yeah because just hearing that but then also hearing like the hotel california too that's the thing i would like to go for as well because you don't really know when he's doing them like we've watched quite a few of him with an acoustic guitar and you really don't know what he's gonna do like he's gonna pull anything out and that's i think the beauty of when you are when it is just you and an acoustic guitar is that you you can do what you want you can just wing it but yeah yeah such a great song that's what yeah that's what i mean i just think chris cornell is i know it the great voice but songwriting too it's just a great song and a great song to that it stands up next to hotel california do you know what I mean? And Hotel California is obviously in the fabric's DNA of, of music. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, that was fire. Fire. But yeah, anyway, that's the reaction. Just...